Yo, what's up everybody? Hopefully you guys are having a good day so far. We're coming at you guys with probably our last loot crate, um, at least as of this year of 2020. Uh, by the time this video is released, it will be well into October, which means we only have a few more months left. Um, this is the special uh, loot crate that we were waiting for. Here you guys go. This is the Deadpool one. We've just now barely opened it up. Um, that's how it came on both sides. Sadly, so it looks like somebody tried to give a little peek at the mailing office. But anyways, let's get into this video. Um, if you guys are liking the content, please share across your entire platforms. We're just trying to grow as much as possible. So without further ado, let's get into this Deadpool Loot Crate video down below. If you want to get a Loot Crate, uh, the link is down below as well. I believe you get $5 off your first Loot Crate. Um, I'll have to double check. But anyways, I'm liking this right here. Oh yeah. Shall we, shall we shall we unwrap the effort? Do you realize you're holding my package? Hell yeah I do. We're holding Deadpool's package. Now, this is actually pretty cool. I mean, you could have this one if you wanted to uh, I think there's stuff in there that's my in my in my size, so Can you have this. Well, this is a bag, right? Yeah, duffel bag. <laughs> Maximum effort. So what this is, you guys, it's just a normal duffel bag. Uh, this is probably why it wouldn't close. But this is actually not... It's actually not that, that small, to be honest with you. Yeah. It's actually pretty cool, you know. So, Joe says he likes this. Um, I'm giving it to him. Yeah, yes, this is my crate uh, because the shirt is in my size. So, there you go, Joe. You can have that. Next up. Bro, I was about to sit there and say, bro, if this was what I thought it would have been, that would have been some crazy-ish. So, next up, you guys probably seen a little bit of it is a Deadpool little plushie. Um, this is a Funi? I'm guessing that's maybe the brand? Um, I don't know. It looks like it's a bear, to be honest. But it's still a pretty cool little, little plushie doll. Um, I will make sure to put this where my dogs cannot get a hold of it. That's actually pretty cool. Um, huh? Yeah, I know. It looks like a dog, but at the same time, like, like a type of bear. I don't know. It might be a. It might be a dog. Just, it, just maybe because of the way that it's. I'm just saying it's like I don't know, you guys. Yeah, in the camera, it definitely looks like it, it's a. It's a dog. So, cool. Next up, we got ourselves a collector's pin. Ooh, I like that one. It says, yes, dude, this is going to be awesome. There's that little collector's pin. A little a little fuzzy. It's not focusing on it. I don't know why this camera is acting the way it is. But, again, this is all off my phone for now. Uh, 2021, we should be looking into getting our normal cameras, normal equipment, and doing some more adventure type things. Next up, make sure this is the right size. If not, yep, okay. Next up, we got my shirt. That's actually pretty cool. Property of what? Property of Club Merc High for troubled youngsters. Wade Wilson. That's actually pretty cool. I, I do enjoy like that shirt. Um, again, like I said, I am actually a big fan of Deadpool. Um, especially after the movies, you know, movies have been real successful. 
And I can't wait to see it, see how Deadpool is introduced into the Marvel Cinematic Universe. That's going to be amazing. And how are they gonna how they're gonna do that? You want my opinion? Go with Deadpool kills the Marvel Universe and have him going from the universe he destroyed into this one. That'd be pretty cool. Because you could kind of introduce an old man Logan to that too. Just saying. Does that say kid pool? Mm. Yeah, that says kid pool. Oh, I thought that was a Ninja Turtle at first. <laughs> so here's the glass. It says kid pool on it. And then on the back, Deadpool, Club Merc. a little closer onto that that's actually pretty cool and i mean we just got to make sure this one we do not put in the wa uh, wa dishwasher and wash them. yeah uh that's what happened with dad's walking dead one <laughs> it ended up in the uh dishwasher and came out clear yeah no it's kind of what there's a random figure got glass in there yeah, it kind of upset me because I was the one that bought it for him, but it is what it is. Stuff happens, you know? And of course, you just have the thanks for being, being a looter. Um, I'll show you guys the box, too. The box is actually pretty cool. So, of course, you got Deadpool talking his smack. says, do you realize you are holding my package? Right? Yeah. And then on the bottom, you got the Deadpool Club Merc. Overall, I'm, I, this is actually pretty cool. This is like one of the best um, boxes we've had so far. Only because the plush, the cup, and the duffel bag. Uh, some of the other ones didn't have all of that um but some of the other ones did have like the bars of soaps the shirts that we liked you know we we both got stuff that we would use in both and not both in all of the um ooh, loot crate uh boxes that we did get um again set this off to the side this will probably be the last loot crate box for us in 2020. Like I said, by the time this video drops, it'll be close to the end of October, I believe. Um, I'll have to look at the schedule because uh, everything is set to re be released on certain times. This hair is pissing me off. <laughs> Sorry, guys. There it goes. Uh, but anyways, you guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, comment uh, what your favorite item was in this. Oop, we forgot the little... Uh, anyway, like I said, comment uh, down below what your favorite item was out of this uh, box. If you guys want, down below is a link to uh, get your own crate. As well as get some energy from Ray's Energy, guys. They came in second place of the Clash for Cans this year, which isn't bad. The, honestly, you guys, I'm going to talk a little right now. The company's only two years old. It's an independent distributor. So with them being as big, as, as small as they are, to get where they got, it's not bad. So that link is down below as well. Uh, it's a sampler pack. You get four cans. Um, all you do is pay shipping. So that's down below as well. Also, uh, the suicide hotline is down below or both of our Instagrams are down below. If you guys need to reach out, talk to somebody, doesn't matter. Um, we will help you out as much as we can. If we cannot, we will refer you to somebody else or even talk to the, uh, suicide hotline, you know, and that's the last thing we need to do is be so negative with all the negative stuff going on in the world. So with that being said, you guys, stay safe, stay positive, don't let the world bring you down, and we will see you guys in the next video. Laters.